14a a body of mass 18 kg okay with a velocity of 18 meter per second collides with another body of mass 20 kg moving with a velocity of 14 meters per second so this body of 18 kg goes this way 18 meter per second just before collision and there is another body mass is 22 kg and this body was already moving at 14 meter per second in same direction after collision the body of 18 kg this one moves with a velocity of 15 okay this after that it is 15 meters per second and the other body with x meters per second this one x meters per second okay in the same direction find the value of x okay so here we can use conservation of momentum okay so according to conservation of momentum m1 u1 plus m2 u2 equal to m1 v1 plus m2 v2 this is the initial velocity u for m1 it is initial velocity for m2 and these are final velocities and we know everything so 18 times 18 plus 22 times 14 equal to 18 times 15 plus 22 times x so we can see x is the only unknown parameter here rest everything is okay so this will be 324 plus uh, this will be 308 equal to 270 plus 22x so uh, 324 plus 308 will be 632 minus 270 equal to 22x. This will be uh, 362 equal to 22x. So 22x means x will be equal to 362 over 22. Let me divide this. And by the time I do this, please subscribe to this channel and motivate me to make such more videos. It came out to be 16.45 uh, meters per second. Let's move on to the B part of the same question, which is the coordinate of the points P, Q, R are these respectively find 2pq plus qr we will have to first find pq let me find pq here whenever they say pq the head you can see of the vector head is on q tail is on p so we find it by subtracting the tail from head so first we write head which is q q is minus 3 2 and in column notation we'll write it minus uh, P is 2, 5. And why I subtracted this? Because the coordinates of P are 2, 5. Actually, it is the vector OP, which is the position vector. So 2, 5 position vector can be written as like this. So we are basically in PQ subtracting uh, OQ, the position vector of Q, minus OP, the position vector of P, and this is what it is. And that will give us PQ. So minus 3 minus 2 will be minus 5. 2 minus 5 is minus 3. This is PQ. Similarly, we'll find QR now. So the position vector of R will be 1, 3 minus position vector of Q, which is minus 3, 2. It is 1 minus minus 3, 4. 3 minus 2, 1. So we know PQ and QR now. And now we can go to our question, which was 2PQ plus 5QR. So 2 times PQ was minus 5 
minus 3 plus 5 times QR which is 4 1 so it will be equal to 2 times minus 5 minus 10 plus 5 times 4 20 2 times minus 3 is minus 6 plus 5 times 1 5 so the answer is minus 10 plus 20 10 minus 6 plus 5 minus 1 that is 2 pq plus 5 qr the unit vector in the direction of pr so we don't know pr right now so pr will be pq pq plus qr we know pq and qr both you could have also done the position vector of r minus position vector of p this is uh, some point p this is some point q if i go from p to q this vector is called pq now there is another another vector r another point r from q to r it will be the vector qr and if i add pq and qr it will be this will be the resultant which is pr and that's why in vectors we can add like this and uh, I could have subtracted the position vector of P, OP basically, from position vector of R, OR minus OP. But uh, this is another way of doing it. That's why I want to explain this to you so that in future addition or subtraction doesn't matter. It should be your aim to get the vector. So PQ is minus 5, minus 3. QR is 4, 1. So minus 5 plus 4 equal to minus 1. Minus 3 plus 1 is minus 2. And we want a vector in direction, unit vector in direction of PR. So to find the unit vector, unit vector in direction of PR is First, we find the mod modulus of PR, the magnitude of PR. So it will be minus 1 square plus minus 2 square. It will be 1 plus 4 square root 5. So divide the vector by its own magnitude and we get the unit vector in direction of that vector so if you want to leave it like this you can leave it like this or you can write this as minus 1 over square root 5 minus 2 over square root 5 both are right answers